Hey everyone, I'm Arbazi and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 5 as Decree. So, let's continue where we left off. I'm working on my armories and I killed up the unique buildings after that. So it will take a while before I start recruiting my frigates. I probably won't have the time to get too many frigates. But we'll see how it goes. Cargo ship. Right, send it to this city instead. And we got a research agreement. That means I need a new one. With William. But that will have to wait a few turns. Should be 525 gold right now. At least he has more than enough gold. I could sell some of my oil. Since I'm about to get more. Right, cargo ship. I should send it to a civilization I don't have a trade route with. So let's see. I got a trade route with Australia. With Germany. And that's that. I could send the trade route to Dublin. Or to Genoa. That also works. Doesn't really matter all that much. Where's Genoa? Right here? Okay, Genoa seems a little bit safer. Okay, next. Theodora declared war on the Celts. Okay. The Celts are going to have a bad time. They are already at war with Germany. And now with Byzantium. And they are also at war with William. They'll get wrecked by Germany, probably. Yeah, Dublin is already taking damage from the looks of it. Oh well, not my problem. I just don't want Germany to get too strong. Because that's not good. Right, next. I'm just basically waiting for frigates right now. And for electronics. Research agreement, yes. I don't need open borders with you. Although, I should get open borders with other order civilizations, which is William, actually. So, I do want open borders, actually. Do I need to protect some antiquity sites? Not really. I got this one, but I'll get an archaeologist in three turns. And also this one, but I'll also get an archaeologist. Okay, let's just get open borders with William. Open borders. And with Theodora. Open borders. Alright, I won't have any problems with ideology pressure anytime soon. That's for sure. I don't want world religion. I don't like voting against it, but... I really don't want world religion. Next. So, I'll get a rationalism finisher in 29 turns. And we also got another research agreement in 11. I won't have a lot of time to build frigates. Yeah, maybe I'll get four frigates max. That's probably all I can build in that time. Get some more farms, I suppose. We got more population. Okay, war religion failed. That's good. I don't want their war religion. We got some more oil. I don't think I'm going to sell oil. I need oil for battleships, and then I'll need oil for some fighters. I'll probably need flight. At least one carrier and a few fighters, if I want to attack Theodora. Because she will have fighters and bombers by the time I get here. So I'll clearly need some anti-air defenses. Alright, next. At least my production is decent now, in this city at least. It could use a seaport, but I don't have the time for that. At least not right now. Especially since I want to get my unique buildings before I get started on frigates. Let's see, this city... I need quite a few buildings here, but I still need more archaeologists. Let's build an aqueduct. You will go here, and I'll just buy that tile. Get that landmark, and get a landmark here. Alright. Now I just need the antiquity sites for artifacts. Which means I'll need at least one museum. Maybe two museums. Not sure if I'll have the time for that. Yeah. Maybe in my capital. We'll see. And yes, I can see the settler. I don't think he can start a city anywhere around here. Maybe down here. I could block that tile with my great artist, I suppose. 
But my other units are busy. They are protecting other antiquity sites. We can buy something for faith. I might just save for either a great engineer or a great scientist. I can't really buy a cannon anyway. I'll probably save up for a great engineer. What are these frigates doing over here? I think they should be attacking Germany. Maybe they are fighting Germany. That's what's going on. Okay, what's this? William declared war on Australia. Alright. There are a lot of wars going on. That's good. Next turn again. I should queue up some frigates already. I don't actually have that much iron. Ivory. I don't think I can trade luxury for a luxury with anyone. I'll just go for 7 gold per turn. So where is this settler going? No, I'm not going to attack the Celts. I'm sure they are a threat to stability. Just protect that antiquity site. And queue up some frigates. One frigate here. One frigate here. What about the capital? I should grab a windmill. I also need a market. Let's get a windmill that will speed up all other buildings. And give me a bit of extra production. The public school is done. I might save up to buy a research lab in my capital once I get plastics. But that's not cheap. Well, Germany has quite a few ships. It will stay here and you can get another farm or maybe another mine. Yeah, that's better. I need production. Another mine here. I can sell my coal again if I want to. Oh, I was trading coal for a luxury, right? Oh, in the hmm. oh I can trade ivory for a luxury. Wait, no. He won't give me a fair deal? Interesting. Okay. Why is he neutral? Oh, right. He has a different ideology. Right. I was thinking about William. What about Germany? No, I'm not going to sell coal. Germany would buy my coal, at least some of it. I can sell some. 225. Yeah, I don't need 8 more coal. This is enough. Next. And I can definitely use the money. How's that next research agreement? 4 more turns. With Australia. So I'll start working on flight, then electronics. And I'll use my rationalism finisher to get plastics. That's the plan. Yeah, the Celts won't give me a fair deal, that's for sure. Might not even be worth selling ivory for free gold per ten. If I'm going to sell ivory, I should sell it to Arabia. I don't think they will give me a lot of money. But 5 gold per ten is a better deal than I would get from the Celts. Right, so you will stay here. This will be a mine. And what else? Another farm here. And this guy was supposed to get a mine. Plus some population. Okay, we're about to start working on frigates and the Celts lost their capital to Germany. That's pretty bad because Germany will get stronger. I hope they won't get too strong. Sell crab, yep. 360. Nice one. I could buy another factory somewhere. I won't have plastics for 20 more turns. Right, mine. Farm. And we're getting that frigate now. It will take 7 turns. Not too bad. Oh, also, I'm down to zero happiness. Okay. Can we buy something? I can buy incense for 9 gold per 10. Probably a good idea. Anything else we can buy? No, not really. That will have to be enough. I'll just build a zoo or something. 
Also, I should just buy that tile. Where is this archaeologist going? He might be going here, perhaps. To the city-state, but I can't protect all these antiquity sites. Just some of them. Yeah, I'm currently protecting three antiquity sites. While I wait for archaeologists. I can't buy this tile directly. Also, I do have open borders with William and Theodora, so I should protect antiquity sites inside my territory too. Or at least keep an eye on them. Anyway, I'll need a worker up here. I should just buy the oil, but William can't buy the oil directly and I can't improve it yet. There's the landmark. Just lock it. Like so. Not a lot of culture, but it's always something. Six turns for that frigate. Yeah, that works. Your research agreement. Byzantium and Germany. Alright, speaking of research agreements, one more turn. For research agreement with Australia. Nothing. I might even be the tech leader after that research agreement. I wouldn't be surprised. I was pretty close to being the tech leader. Oh, it already triggered on this turn. Right. Let's get a new one then. Welcome back. Oh, he declined the creation of friendship. Well, I suppose that's not surprising. He has a different ideology. That's okay. I still got three more research agreements. Now. Well, now we wait for electronics. That's still the plan. I might need more iron. Let's see. Queue up another frigate. And next. Sell ivory? That's not my last copy, is it? I'll just do it on my turn. My happiness is a little bit low. I'll have to build zoos somewhere. More improvements. And caravan. I could really use a cargo ship right now. I could send that caravan to this crappy city, mostly to maximize the bonus from my unique building. That would be a pretty crappy trade route. Wait, this was for to my capital. Yeah, I guess I can keep using that for now. Speaking of my capital, can we make it grow faster? No, probably not. 11 turns. 10 turns. And the windmill will be done in three turns still. Okay. Plus one population again. Alright, next. Open borders with you? No, not really. That settler next to my capital seems to be stuck. Anyway, I can sell this. 360. And I should sell my World Congress vote. Also, yet another great artist in seven turns. And I don't have any slots. Yeah. I need to just build an opera house somewhere in my capital. How many turns would that take? Eight turns. I guess I'll do it. I could save them for golden ages, but I want some more tourism. Aqueduct. Granary next. Yep. Especially since I got wheat next to that city. Alright, so three more turns for that frigate. Ten turns here. Not much I can do here to speed it up, but I should get a quarry on that stone. Not the best production tile ever, but it's always something. Two more turns to get flight. And I'll check the tech ranking after flight. Yes, you will just stay here. Next. My capital is still growing nicely. I'll switch it to production eventually. Once I get enough population to work all the specialist slots and also work all the good production tiles. The mines, resources. Okay, Sydney, yep. And this was Munich. Alright. And one of my deals ended. Oh, I lost copper and can't buy it? Yeah, I can buy it. Maybe I should trade some oil and some aluminum? 
Will he accept a deal like this? Go gold pair chain? Yeah, that's a decent deal. I didn't necessarily want to sell 5 oil, but I'm okay selling 2 oil and 2 aluminum. And this settler is clearly stuck. He's not moving at all. Not that I mind, I don't want any troll cities. I'm pretty sure there are no more valid locations for cities other than maybe some of these tiles. In fact, this exact tile would be a valid location for a city. Yeah, where my gunstock warrior is. We got a frigate. Let's see. Bombardment 1, Bombardment 2. And we got 30 out of 60 experience. Did the unique building actually work then? I don't think it did. And I do have the unique building here. I don't think that worked. Anyway, this city has a different combat monos. So the frigate will heal faster when outside of my borders. Which doesn't benefit frigates or battleships all that much. But it will if I get supply promotion. I still need to build frigates here, because I need them fast. We'll get electronics in 11 turns. Or 10 turns. From the research agreement with Bismarck. I'll get a lot of science in 12 turns. A rationalism finisher and two research agreements. Yeah, that will be a huge amount of science in one go. Let's check the tech ranking real quick. Technology is discovered. 53. And I'm at 52. Okay, so I will be the leader in 12 turns easily. I'm only one tech behind. I'll need at least one carrier for sure. Also, once I'm done with this Opera House, I'll probably get started on some fighters. But I wouldn't mind an armory. I might just buy a museum in my capital to get the two great works. I don't have the time to build one. So I'll just buy one. That will be much faster. Oh, we actually stole a technology. Okay. I wasn't even looking at my spy. I can steal a refrigeration. That's the best tech to steal. That will allow me to get the oil. And I can just sell the oil. Or use that tile for production. How many turns? To get a workboat? Five turns. Or I can just buy one. Although I'll have to buy that tile too. Okay, work about first. Archaeologists can wait. Silver for crab. Yep, accept. Oh, and I didn't sell the World Congress vote. Should probably do that. Let's see what's going on in the World Congress. Ban gold. World ideology order. Yeah, I want that. I definitely want that. And she will pay me to vote for that. That's perfect. Let's see. How much can we get? 600? 550. I'll go down 50 at a time. And she will accept eventually. 450 gold! Not bad, considering I was going to vote for that anyway. Also, happiness is going to be a problem in a moment. I might have to buy a Zoe instead. I need so many things. I need a museum. I need some Zoes for happiness. I need units. I need to balance all of that. And let's scout around a bit. Hmm. Fastest way to get happiness. That's a zoo in my capital. I'm still allied with Samarkand. Are there any more mercantile city-states? Antwerp. But Australia is almost 200 influence ahead of me. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. What about Singapore? I could bribe the city, but I would need a lot of money. The leader has 16,000. I have 2,500. Yeah, okay. I don't think I'll be getting any happiness from city-states. I can go for happiness from monuments, but I kind of want the rationalism finisher for now. Well, there's the great artist. And I need to move back. Yep. This should be mine. No, that's not exactly what I had in mind. 295 gold. 
Okay, maybe not. Then again, I got 3000. So that's not exactly a problem. I want more production. More improvements. I wouldn't mind this hill either. Yeah, let's just buy this. I need the production. Okay, hold on. I need to check my trade routes. I already have a trade route with Australia, with Venice, and with Germany. So I could use a trade route with Dublin, but Dublin might fall. I could get a crappy trade route with William, but I don't think that's worth doing. Just for a little bit of extra experience for my frigate. No, not really. I'll just go for the money. Granary. Grab a market then. Oh. This city is also taking damage. Okay. Well, my goal is still Constantinople. That did not change. What's going on? Kabul. I don't care about that. One more turn for the workboat. This will be mine. This guy can go get some improvements over there. And now I can just buy a museum. It's not cheap, but whatever. I'm doing it anyway. Oh yeah, I need to be close to the city. And I should be able to get the theming bonus. Oh, I can get the trade route with Arabia from here. That's not a bad idea, I suppose. Not much to see here. I might have to get a submarine or two if I want to attack Byzantium. Yeah, I'll need at least one or two submarines. I'll need at least one carrier with some fighters. And I need several battleships and I'll need at least one or two privateers. I'll need a lot of things to take Constantinople reliably and not get wrecked instead. Oh, the settler actually moved. All right. Go you. Farm. Or lumber mill for more production. The factory will be done in nine turns. So next. Also the research agreement. Six more turns. We got... Landmark. Already working that. I could use more culture. I could use historical landmarks. That would be nice. Lumber mill. And we got more oil. Are we working that tile? Yep. Also, I still need a settler. I mean, a worker to the north. So this guy, after he finishes the farm. Now, let's check that theming bonus. Can definitely get one. Oh, I already have one. Right. Never mind. So, frigate. Okay. Bombardment 1, Bombardment 2. And that's 30 out of 60 experience. Okay. Cargo ship. To Genoa. I'm not convinced the unique building is actually working properly. Another frigate. Bombardment. I'll have submarines. If I want to attack other ships. Do we have time for another frigate? Also, I mean negative happiness, which is not great. Can I not get a deal with Arabia? Oh, Probably not. No, they won't give me a fair deal. And the Celts won't give me a fair deal either. Well. Alright, I could just buy a zoo. Which I might, but not in this city. I should just buy a zoo in lowest production city. So one of these two. Either this one or this one. That's 1000. I'm not entirely convinced it's worth doing because I'm about to get plastics in four turns. So that means... I'll need... how much? Yeah, 1800 gold to buy a research lab, which is still the plan. I might just hard build that zoo in my capital. 
Yeah, five turns is not a big deal. I can just switch this city to production. To speed it up. Not much point focusing it on food when I'm in negative happiness anyway. So, like this. That's four turns to get the zoo. I might just do that. Can we speed it up more? No, four turns is the best we can do. Actually, maybe it's not. No, I don't want to sell that. Can we get three turns? No. Okay, never mind. I thought I might be able to get three turns, but no. Okay, four turns and lock the specialist slots. And the frigate. So I would have to build a frigate in four turns, which is clearly not going to happen. These are all the frigates I'll get. Or I can start building a frigate and then continue building a battleship. But I actually need at least one or maybe two submarines. Let's get started on submarines then. Change these cities to production. Lock that landmark just in case. I still need that quarry. And I also need one worker over here. This guy can go there. This guy is not quite done yet. So, oh yeah, lock this. And... Well, that looks like the most production we can get at the moment. I'm just making sure all the landmarks are locked. Wouldn't want to miss out on culture. Switch this city to production as well. I'm switching everything to production while I'm in negative happiness. No need to switch this city to anything. It's already working all the decent tiles in the area. Alright, so that's that. I'll just hard build that zoo. I will take happiness from monuments, but I need Rashtal in finisher first. Also, Arabia just built the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> you know what that means? I want it. Which city was that in? In their capital. Alright, I might go for their capital after Constantinople. Not a terrible idea. Wait, is it going to be faster to reach Constantinople by going east? No. Okay, nine turns. Okay, it's definitely faster to go west. I was just checking. Although I'm already closer. But I have some territory here. I can upgrade to battleships here. I'm not quite ready to go there yet. I still need some fighters. I need some carriers. However, I'm going to finish this part here and continue in next one. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.